see if this, or if this beginning part shows a little bit with the metallic kind of handled two different ways. So here you can use the uh, drawing end or the photo give you a better rendition and taking the pen tool and trying to illustrate the top as well as the side and let them overlap so you can use the shape builder to make them so that they have a seamless fit. And then the parts that are cut out you can kind of arbitrate which is the best option. This metal part is just the stroke with the gradient on the, on the line of the stroke and here it's just a fill using the mesh tool so it'll build those two pieces up and then going ahead and using either a gradient for the coloring or a combination of the mesh tool to help you click and create some of the shading inside of it. So it'll give you two, two options uh, to illustrate it with. So you have this piece and when you finish it, go ahead and give it a drop shadow. You can illustrate it with the pen tool. Just kind of follow the outside piece, send it to the back to put everything behind it. The gradient goes from the stroke to the fill. Just shift X to send it to the back. You can blur the edges to it just to give you a little bit more feel to it and then just do a screenshot of that to make it a ping file.